Uh, right now, it's 25 degrees colder than it was this time yesterday. You probably need a coat. I mean, yesterday, of course, we got into the upper 70s. Today, we got a cold front, and here it is. This is the last six hours, and you can see it's sweeping across North Texas. And of course, now we're on the cold side of that cold front. If you're out this afternoon earlier, yeah, temperatures were in the upper 50s. They've been dropping all afternoon, and now we're sitting in the low 50s, and that's with a brisk wind. There was rain in the forecast. Remember, I was talking about yesterday about our first measurable rain in the forecast. We did not get it at DFW. It was just a trace of rain. There was some measurable rain across our northeast counties, but it was in the tenths of inches measured. Trace, like I said, at the airport officially, that's the third time we've seen just a trace of rain, but now we're about two inches short for the month and above for the year, but it's the driest start to November we've had in 15 years. Here's Futurecast. We have the clouds around now. They're going to help hold those temperatures a little bit, but we end up down into the mid-40s, which is really just typical for this time of year. It's a chilly start to your Monday, but temperatures warm up into the low 60s. Again, it does, it's going to feel colder just because of the warm weather of late, but that's only typical for this time of year, a temperature in the 60s like that. Hey, precipitation chances are ahead. I know it's been very dry here this month, like I was saying, but we have a couple more chances of rain in the forecast this week on the holiday. Here's the first one on Tuesday. Could be some thunderstorms in the mix here, not necessarily severe weather, but some thunderstorms. Now we're in the warm sector through the day. We in the, we're in the mid 70s and it's very windy. Then the cold front comes through and it sweeps the rain away, but it, not probably until the overnight hour. So Tuesday night, some rain and then Wednesday morning, clearing skies and temperatures in the 40s and windy. Here's the other chance of rain right after Thanksgiving on Black Friday. It looks like a low is going to slowly be moving right overhead. So we have rain and thunderstorms on Friday, even into Friday night. And yeah, that's snow in the panhandle going on. Temperatures on Saturday only in the 50s, and it looks like Sunday will be even colder than that. So we're going to have to deal with a little bit of rain as we get into the weekend. We haven't seen anything like this in rainfall potential in a while. Some good rains possible, two to three inches in our eastern counties. And look at this. As we close the month, start December, a chance of below normal temperatures. That's the first time we've seen that this month. As we take a look at the seven-day forecast, look at Thanksgiving. 72 degrees and partly sunny. A nice day. And then, of course, the day after, rain. And look at Sunday, only in the mid-50s.